Of course, it's been really cold outside lately, and we're not the only ones that are dealing with it. It's mm -hmm. really having an effect on farmers here in central New York. Dairy farmers especially. This morning, Brandon Roth is live at Easy Acres Dairy Farm in Homer. Brandon? Hey, good morning, guys. That's right. It's been a tough winter for everyone, especially dairy farmers. And we're here with one of our favorite dairy farmers, Mark McMahon, Easy Acres. And, and Mark, it's not just you guys, but you represent all dairy farmers across central Nor New York, right? It's the yeah. same story. Yeah, it's 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 New York State. It's yeah. wintertime in New York State, and, yeah. and it's difficult. So, yeah. yeah. One of the things that problem people realize is, is the labor is so labor intensive. Like, you have to, the water, for example, freezes. Yeah, water freezes, manure freezes. Uh, yeah. And we have to deal with it all day. We've got to make sure that all of our animals, and there's over 1,300 on our farm, have got you know ample fresh water every day. Yeah. Uh, it's it's just a it's extra work that we right. don't normally have to do. The manure is is interesting because normally. Uh, it's you're able to now it's, it, it freezes so it's a lot harder to get rid of yeah it, it all has to be done mechanically yeah. instead of being able to be pumped yeah. and you know it just goes through the through the holes in the floor and goes into yeah. a tank none of that works and you actually have a guy that chops up their water you have we to have, chop the, we've got a guy that comes in almost every day and all he does is is chop yep. yeah just keep the ice off and keep the water going to the animals yeah. how much more labor do you think it's uh, costing for dairy farmers oh. in this kind of winter that we've had. <laughs> it's hard to say. Yeah. I mean, my brother says, and I agree with him, that what takes a half an hour to do in the summer takes a half a day in the wintertime. So, yeah. you know, there's a lot of costs that yeah. come up. You know, it's just we have to increase the energy levels in the feed. That's expensive. And it's tough because you guys are already in a tough spot. We've, and, and now... It's not like milk prices are going to go up because those prices are fixed. So well, those prices are dropping. Yeah. Milk so, prices dropping, and we and yeah. so no, we can't we so, can't charge more for our milk yeah. to cover these costs. Right. So you already had a small profit margin. It's going to get even tougher for dairy farmers after this winter. Oh yeah. yeah this yeah. winter has made it tough. This winter has made it tough for yeah. sure. Yeah. 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 Well, spring's supposedly coming. <laughs> That's what they say. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see about that. But uh, well, thanks for having us again. Uh, Guys, you heard them. You know, it's uh, tough. Milk prices are going down. It's already been a tough time for the dairy industry, and this, this winter is just making things tougher for them. But uh, hopefully, Matt Stevens can let us know it's going to warm up soon. But for now, tough times here for dairy farmers this winter. We're live at Easy Acres Dairy Farm in Homer. Brandon Roth for today in central New York.